radial tear repair. After release of each radial tear edge, two 2.4 millimeter tunnels are reamed at the menisco capsular region of the tibia with the center of the tunnels located 5 millimeters apart and on either side of the radial meniscus tear. A number two ultra braid suture is first passed through the posterior corner of each meniscal flap using a non-cutting needle. Typically, suture passage is performed through one anterior medial portal with a first pass self-capture suture passer device. A lasso can be used to shuttle each number two suture in a crisscross fashion through the transosseous tunnels. The anteriorly replaced sutures are passed through the posterior transtibial tunnel and the posteriorly place sutures are passed through the anterior tunnel. Applying a traction force to the transtibial sutures reduces the meniscus into its final position and the suture ends exiting the tibial tunnels are tied using a standard surgeon's knot over a button on the anterior medial tibial cortex with the knee in 90 degrees of flexion. The restoration of the shape and stability of the repair is confirmed by visualization and probing. Standard inside-out meniscal sutures are used to further strengthen the construct.